Hello, I'm Martin Fenska and welcome to another episode of Let's Play Battle Brothers. So today we can finally start the expedition. We have been waiting for this for quite a while. It was like four or five episodes maybe. Uh, so the plan is get to Adlerberg, then follow the road, explore this uh, small area that we didn't explore yet, and then uh, stick to the uh, northern side of the map. Get all the way to the corner and basically reveal, let's say, this whole area. And of course, we are specifically looking for orcs. We need three more camps so that we fulfill our ambition. Uh, let's go to Adlerberg first then. I want to check, actually, before I do anything, uh, let's make sure I don't forget to equip the dagger. Who wants to get that? That's a good question. Do we have any anyone, basically, with the... Uh, uh, dagger mastery. Our spearmen have dagger mastery. Uh, we have a dagger mastery here. What if I just gotten rid of the battle standard as the main weapon and go all in with the dagger? You'll see how that works. You can always switch back. Let's see if we can find something along the way. There might be something here, I would say. Probably not, but worth checking. And can you make it to Adlerberg before the night? wanted to uh, check all the shops but we are too late of course uh, you want me to kill green skins kill marauding green oh that's not gonna happen sorry and what are you missing hmm. the thing is if you find something interesting then you'd spend most of our money probably would be buying, of course, just unique items. And uh, we'd most likely spend all the money and then have, have to delay the expedition. So let's just, let's just keep going. Uh, soon enough, if you heard, I would be on the borderlands. I want to go exploring. Okay, let's go all the way here. And from there we head north. You have to be careful in this area and make sure we don't run into some vampires. But during the day we should be safe. Okay, fine. Now we can head north. I hope we find something interesting because if we don't, if we don't come back with a full inventory of like expensive stuff, this is a bit of a waste of time. Also, want to check up here just in case. With the new locations from the uh, from the expansion, uh, yeah, this is good. There might be a location. I think if we climb one mountain, we should be able to see, see everything around here. Nope, nothing at all. Oh, so far it's pretty empty. I expected at least something. No patrols even. Okay, let's uh, camp under the mountain. In the morning we'll climb up and have a look around. Wow. 
Well, that's what I call a disappointment. Okay, let's go south and we'll follow this side. Are we too far to the north? How far? Oh, that's still a long way. Oh, look at that. There is nothing here. Oh, there is something. Uh, that's actually good. I remember this one. Uh, this will just reveal a large part of the map. There shouldn't be any fights or anything. Uh, okay, if you want to read all of this, just pause the video, please. And as you can see, we have revealed a huge part of the map and didn't find anything. Um, yeah. Where are all the orcs? It has to be something. Map can't be this empty. This is a coast, so we don't have to go all the way to the corner. Oh, hello. First sign of... Uh, or first sign that something actually lives here. Oh, there is another sign. Many orc bear circus. Yeah, I'll take that. Hope that they will now find multiple camps very close together. Because so far this has been a huge waste of time. Engage. Okay, hopefully most of them have their two handers because they're, those are most expensive. One, two, three, and one more we don't know about yet. That's also a two hander. Okay, so that's the priority target, especially the one with the axe. Wait. Uh, yeah, definitely a spear wall. Kill at least this one. How the hell did you survive the second shot? is gone. Could hurt. Which one goes first? This one and yeah, this one, yeah. Doesn't feel better. Is he trying to flee? Well, this one is trying to flee, that's good. Great. 
something to warm up uh, oh where did this come from and it's not even a orcish weapon this is just a unique 200 x that uh, doesn't have the increased fatigue requirements uh, orcish weapons have problem is i think it's a pretty bad roll uh we'll take it everything except the meat of course leave and let's compare it to a normal 200 eggs oh wait this is not a normal 200 eggs yeah this one is so much better for 150 damage to shield this one is lighter and has bet. No, it doesn't even have. What the hell is. I'll have to find uh, or check somewhere in the shop a uh, normal two handed weapon. I'm two handed weapon, two handed axe. And compare what's well, actually better here. I think it's durability, fatigue, and shield damage. So the three worst rolls. Hmm, we can just sell this one. It's pretty bad. It's quite disappointing. Uh, level up for Edmund. What do we want to give Edmund? I think indomitable. We have what one, two, three, four points still. Yeah, I'll give him fast adaptation. Indomitable. Maybe rotation. And Pathfinder. Let's start with the rotation. Oh, look at that fatigue. Actually, I'm pretty disappointed now. The moment I realized it's not an orcish weapon, I was so excited I might have found a good weapon actually. And it was so bad. Or it is so bad. Some orc warriors. This could be a fun fight. Okay. Uh, let me check. I want to see if there is an island sometimes. There might be islands. No, I don't think so. This is going to be pretty tough. How many warriors? One, two, three, four, five. Ah, oh, maybe not. Wait, wait. With the orc young around them, if we kill enough, they should panic. That guy has to go down. These are all Orc Young. Wait, wait. Wait. Three, four. Did I miss one of them? One, two, three, four. Is it only four warriors? Okay, fine. I thought there were five. Ah. Oh, 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 oh,
also a Berserker, right? Yeah. Can I knock them back? Which I'm not sure about that, but... I think I'll move Prophet first. Yeah, I thought so. Please, headshot. Almost everyone will get stunned, most likely. Oh, no. They were not close enough. Uh, let's try... This warrior. She'll, she'll have a pretty good chance to hit half. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Wait. Wait. I'll have to move Shade up, because always when Tobiarin moves back like this, Kamehameha stays, stays alone, but he doesn't have an AoE attack. And with that axe we have uh, the AoE uh, cleave, oh no it's not cleave, it's a round attack. So they'll def definitely be a bit better when he swap Shade north. <laughs> Ah, oh, come on. That's unfortunate. Okay. Uh, wow, that hurt. I have to get rid of uh, these two as quickly as possible and start moving everyone north to flank the remaining two warriors. Wait. Okay, where do we start? I could try to kill. That's, that looks fine. That's quite a lot of damage. Uh, not bad for a dagger. He knew that he wouldn't be able to hit uh, anything, basically, with uh, those overwhelm stacks and uh, with such a low morale. So he went for the guaranteed uh, hits to the shield. That was pretty smart. Okay, this one is done. Uh, Edmund. Let's just play the save. Shields up. Tired, damn it. Oh, that's fine. We got this. Uh, wait, wait. Uh, 
too far, seriously? Okay, let's make sure we have those overwhelm stacks. Still a lot of damage though. Gonna take a while. We have tools and supplies, problem is it's uh, gonna take some time to repair. <clears throat> Wait. Ah. Okay. I'll level up for Kamimutsu. What about some interesting items? No, nothing this time. Okay, 22 tools and supplies. They'll basically have wasted. Ah. And we need what? Yeah, we just wasted the tools and supplies that we need after this white to repair everything. And um, I think it's time to swap. We have to find, or do we have to find another shield? We can just check the stash first, just in case. But I don't think that we have a spare shield. But uh, we can use this one. This is 190. Just wait for this armor. Uh, we should be able to repair it in like a day. Now, Kamiyamutsu. Plus one, plus one, plus one. We need one more. Let's try to find that one last camp today. There should be orcs everywhere in this part of the map. We can rest here to speed up the repairs you lose dried fruits it's unfortunate how much food do we have only for five days and i should check at least it's not about the spoil but we have to be careful this whole thing took a little bit longer than i expected i thought that uh, we won't get all the way to the coast basically i thought we would just uh, have a full inventory halfway Oh, that was something. Many berserkers. Uh, some young, some warriors. Don't really care about this group. I just want camps. Wait. Wait. I'll just wait for them to come closer. I'll first focus again on the two handers. How many are there? Four. I'm surprised that Berserkers panic so easily.
of this one? Nope. Didn't I say something about switching Kamimutsu and Shade? Ah. Come on, let's try to kill them before they can... Panicked, so that's basically a kill. Wait, can I somehow climb up and still attack? I doubt that. We can try. No. <laughs> So much unnecessary damage. I knew that would happen. Okay, first. What is this? Uh, uh, I don't think we need mushrooms. Let's take the weapons. Oh, well, we have room in the inventory, so we can get some extra gold when we sell those mushrooms. And that's enough for the ambition. Like, like half day. Not even half day, it was basically instant. Uh, we get out a trophy. Where is it? Grants immunity to being stunned. There should be one more slot for uh, these necklaces and things. Because I'm pretty sure I'm not wearing the dog around my neck. So I have no idea why this should be in the same slot. And why am I giving this to Kamehameha when I want to give it to Shade? Anyone missing a dog? I don't think so. I'm gonna give this dog to Gizzle Hair. And how long do we still have? Five days. Can we get to the civilization in five days. I have to be careful, because we are very far from all cities. Adlerberg is still the closest one. It's ideal like to explore a bit more around the coast and then go back, explore here. Then probably return to Adlerberg and sell everything in Hellestad. The prices in Hellestad are so much better than anywhere else. Come on. Okay, but we are not going this way. I didn't expect mountains to be everywhere there have to be some camps is it possible that we missed camps i don't think so no there's no way we missed any camps here but these orgs have to come from somewhere 
There has to be, I would say there is a, a large camp here. Or maybe not. Where is everything? Oh, we can cross back again. There's nothing. Okay, let's just camp on the plains, on the, the mountain. Then we climb, check if there's anything around, and uh, start moving back. But so far, this has been a huge disappointment. Goblins, okay. So, there are goblin lands to the south. Where are all the orcs? Which is some renown, but now you can see real fame on the horizon. Let's defeat the formidable force of two dozen opponents in battle. Uh, 24. Well, if we start killing goblins, 24 is not a problem. Also, undead can easily reach 24 plus. We could go with that. Our company is still prepared to fight armored opponents. We shall train two men to master the hammer in combat. No knight will be safe from us. I don't think I want to give a second hammer to someone at this point. And I think commands respect as a trophy of a giant beast of the frozen wastes. Let's go uh, hunt and get the taxidermy some work. Now, let's take the first one. It's probably the easiest one to fulfill. I'm not sure how the taxidermist one works exactly. Oh, hey, black monolith. Yeah, at least we know where it is, but... Uh, uh, yeah, definitely not prepared for that. Come on, where are all the orcs? At this point, I'll take anything. Many orc warriors, some bear circus, many orc young. So this could be eight orc young, five bear circus. I think if I remember the numbers, that's 16, 23. This could be 24 orcs. Um, I don't think we are quite ready for a fight like that. I'd probably risk this if it was in the forest, where they would have to split up. We couldn't come as one huge group. It's tempting though. It's really tempting. Because the numbers are not that insane. I could move Edmund back. Kite, let's say one or two with profit. This is a horrible idea. Well, um, I'll think about this. Also, I'll check um, if I can if I could shuffle uh, the composition around a little bit. Uh, maybe swap Tobier and, and Akredon. Maybe give the 200 X to Rudolf for this height. That could also work. And did I forget to pick up loot from one fight? I have a feeling that I forgot to pick up some, some loot. 
Oh, well. Yeah, you'll see about this. I will have to think about this why if it's worth the risk. We kind of need the loot, so that's a, a reason to try this. And also, <clears throat> the numbers are not that insane. Usually in these like large orc cities, you find like plethora of orc young, and you just get overwhelmed. Um, there is many orc young, many warriors, and some berserkers. The numbers are not that that crazy, but it's still a lot of orcs that we can find. So, we will see about this. I can't promise anything, it's very risky. Uh, for today we are definitely done though, so I hope that you liked this episode, I hope that you can join me next time again. And until then, have a good time, bye bye.